Welcome to part 4 of building the kids play loft. This time we will be making the ladder, which will double as a safety rail on the stairs, and the safety net up top to match the bunk bed. Let's get started. I'm using 2x2s for the styles and the bottom rail, and a 2x4 for the top rail that runs against the ceiling. Here I have marked out the direction I need to cut 15 degree angle on the top of the styles in order to match the pitch of the ceiling in the bedroom. Here I have marked out where I need to make a 45 degree cut in order to avoid bumping it while climbing the stairs. My layout for drilling will be at 3 inches on center and I'm drilling 7 64 inch pilot holes to accept some eye screws and half inch holes for the rope to go through. You'll see how those are used later on. These are the steps for the ladder, and I'm cutting a 5 degree inward bevel in order to give the kids feet better purchase while they climb. After putting in the eye screws with the drill, I used a screwdriver by hand to finish aligning the eye screws nicely. For this pattern we needed an odd number of holes and eye screws, and each intersection of rope is tied in a square knot. All in all we ended up using 4 packs of 100 foot quarter inch nylon rope. There was a little bit of leftover, but we needed long enough lengths in order to avoid splicing pieces of rope. is now functional and the kids love it. However, it is not yet completed. 
In the last episode of this build, we will be finishing the ceiling under the loft and the floor trim up top. It's taking a lot of time and effort for this part, but it's going to look really cool. Stay tuned for the detail work.